Hello guys, LittleBuddy524 here, and welcome back to another episode of A Whole New World. I know it's been a while since we played, uh, but we're going to get right back into this real quick. <clears throat> I have a couple things that I want to talk about. First, I just want to say I haven't been recording um, this series regularly, because, of, um, and this takes a lot of work to start really, I don't know, getting into things. So, what we're going to do today... <clears throat> is we're gonna build a um it's like a watchtower I guess so I, I laid it out in a creative world um in by myself my um test world and so we're just gonna start building it it's fairly simple that super axe there that I have geez anyways I'm gonna throw a torch in there just to light that up in the middle don't want anything to spawn in there ever and I think we're going to go five up. So that's four. Two, three. And we're going to go up one more layer after this. <clears throat> mm, nope. Too many layers. But we'll put the ladders on the side of it. I don't know. I've, I'm also having an idea... I'm kind of trying to figure out how I'm going to lay out the the pathway for this area. Um, I think I want to put just a pathway kind of a lot like this one here, this stone brick and um, cobblestone mix all through. But I also might go with gravel, and then I want to put a bridge right across here too. So, <clears throat> I don't know. Let me go, Let me know what you guys think about that. But I was thinking that that probably will look nice. Alright, so we gotta put one here. Oh. Um, I think, I lay it, like, I got all the supplies exactly measured out, so if it doesn't, um, work perfectly the first time, it's because I got something wrong. And I know that we need two, four, six, eight. Eight, I think eight for the top part of this, so that'll tell us how much, um, how high we need to make this, this part of it. So we got 11. <clears throat> Let's put these here. I think it's only four. So, uh, I, I think it looks pretty good when it's all done, but I don't know. Um. I don't know if it's going to really fit with the rest of these buildings, considering... I, I guess I kind of tried to use the same materials and stuff like that. So, it shouldn't look too different. Alright, so, there's a problem. Oh, right there, okay. I see what our problem is. We just need to level... Whoa. We need to level out this area right here. <clears throat> That's all. So, let's get our dirt out. Smooth this off. Uh, kind of make it look a little more natural. Because I hate it when things don't look like they're supposed to be there. Alright. Climb up this side. I guess we don't really need ladders on this side and this side. The one that I made in my my uh, <clears throat> test world has them on all sides. But, so these sit here like this. Okay, yes, this is how we made it. Like that. And then, same idea on this side. But, considering we have no need for the other ones, these other entrances, we can fill these up instead. Um, do I need three there, or should there be two there? Oh, there should only be two here. Um... So put that there then. <clears throat> and then I, I was actually um, experimenting with uh, using fence gates as like a kind of a finishing decoration. So we'll, I'll show you how I did those too, just to let you see. Um, and then we'll do that there on top. And here and in this corner right here. I wish I had a mouse for this. It would be so much easier. <clears throat> okay, and then for the roof, 
We'll do that next, but first, let's get these all laid out. Put that there. And then what I was doing for the fence gates is I was doing this and putting them as like a decorative piece all the way around. And I guess we're going to have to change it up a little bit because we don't have the... Oh, gee. I'm stuck here, aren't I? It's just like the sheep. Oh, MLG. MLG jumping right here. Huh. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay, I'm not that good. Why did I hear a zombie there for a minute? Might have to go down there. Oh, man. I need some food. Eat the food. Or else I'm going to die. It's also starting to get a little bit dark out here, so... Um... Depending on what it looks like. Okay, listen. Makes it much easier. Boom! Look at that skill. De yeah, depending on what it looks like, I think I might... Um, try and do this all the way along the edge here. Oh yeah, we need these here. But for now, we're just going to put them on either side. Like that. Actually, yeah, we don't need one in the middle then. Because, whoop, where are we? Nope, wrong, wrong material. I love my sh my axe, though, like, so fast. Perfect for doing this kind of stuff, because you want it done really quick. Okay, so we got to... I don't know if anybody else knows this, but uh, doors and uh, fence po fence gates and stuff like that, they all act as bud switches. Um, I don't know if you guys know what a bud switch is, but basically, if there's a block update beside them, <coughs> um, a bud switch is a redstone thing. I think we, I actually showed you what a bud switch is in one of my, that uh, redstone tutorial sort of deal that I did. Um, that's what makes my door work over there, the, the head, that head door there. But, yeah, that's basically what a fence gate is, or a door. You can't really use them that I know of to control any redstone sort of, de sort of things and anything like that, but, um, I think it's only, uh, like, player player um what's my word what's the word i'm looking for i'm looking for a word it only responds to players um whereas a buzz switch if you were to update something like a like a the grass growing or the grass ungrowing um it would actually react to that so we'll grab that stuff there Plop a light up here. And we got ourselves the watchtower. I think probably going to have two entrances like this just to make it look a little bit different. See, I really wish we had uh, different color different color um, fence, fences. I would have some like dark, dark wood fences there or something. I just realized yesterday that this is not lit up very well on the inside or the outside. So we'll just throw a light there, light here, and then we'll do this. Put a ceiling in there. Oh, I guess we're out of material. Yeah, I'll finish up the ceiling later, uh, but for now, I'm gonna go, whoa, uh oh, no! Why do you explode? Creepers suck. No, uh-uh. Oh, <sighs> okay, <clears throat> so we're going to go, right now I want to light this up quick, because that might help us prevent the creeper spawns a little bit, or the mob spawns. I don't know how well it will, but it definitely will. Although I really don't want there to be lights everywhere like this. We might have to figure out a way to hide them, or once they bring out like the redstone um, lamps and things like that, We'll definitely have to 
work that out. I also added a new button right here. This does the same thing as the one down below. Just closes up the doors. So you can hide away at night. We're going to take a nap. And then <clears throat> we can get started on the bridge, I think. This episode's just going to be pretty much all building. I haven't built in a while, so I think it's uh, about time that I do some of that. So we want stone brick stairs. Do we have stone? Or do we have stone brick? Yep, yeah, we have some stone brick. And here's some stone brick stairs that are left over. We might need some stone brick slabs. So we'll just make all that stuff really quick right here. And boom, 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 boom. Lots of that stuff. And some stone bricks to those. And I think we'll use the dark wood. And I know we have lots of fences in here somewhere. Lots of fences, sweet open up the doors now we run because there might be people coming to get us oh no oh thank god for the water all right um also i want to say say thank you to you guys for getting me to 110 subscribers thank you very much for that and um, I don't know if I really officially addressed that, but thank you for the 100 subscribers also. Um, so, this will give us a nice little view of the town, actually. I This will probably be my new favorite spot. We also need to go out here and explore some of this uh, terrain out there. We can maybe even fi figure out if we have a nether fortress one of these days. I think we did go and find one, but I'm not sure. And I think we also need to go... And look for some other thing. We need to go find, uh, oh, the end portal in our world. So that we can start doing some end stuff and um, kind of enchanting. More enchanting once I get an ender ender built. Uh, I might show you guys how to do that. That's not my expertise because that's uh, very much involving redstone. Um, for also, also, for all you guys that aren't following me on Twitter, uh, please go and follow me on Twitter. I do post a lot of updates about the channel and what's happening with my life, pretty much. Um, I try as much as I can to not spam everybody. But every once in a while when I'm talking to somebody on Twitter or um, discussing things for the Game True podcast and things like that with fellow people, fellow youtubers and things like that um it might get out a little out of control but other than that i try not to spam uh because i know it's annoying i know i get personally annoyed when other people do it so okay i think we're gonna have some support there in those spots right there and right here and then that's where we're gonna start this sort of thing okay and I want to make this a little bit of an arch but I'm not sure exactly how much of an arch so I think up one like this maybe cap it off with a half slab on both let's see how's that look yes that's what we need so let's get a little bit of, a little bit more of this and we'll get some spruce half slabs here going Okay. Boom, there we go. And I think we'll keep the theme of the uh, dark wood running all the way along here. And I don't think it has to go up higher than that, really. For a couple blocks. Maybe we'll go up one more. I'm not sure. <clears throat> And then we'll level out the land to there. Um, so we come across here again. And we're out. I'm going to quickly run over here. I think I have... Oh, no I don't. We'll have to run up into the house really, really quick. <clears throat> uh, what else? What else can I talk to you guys about? It's been so long since I've recorded. I don't really know what I've done. Mainly last week was just a lot of me being sick. It was not exciting at all me being sick 
complaining about it the whole time. Um, oh, yes, I got a job. That's why I was going with the the whole, you guys should follow me on Twitter. Um, I just got a job, so uh, the YouTube thing might slow down a little bit. I'm going to try and keep it up as much as I can. Uh, I had my first shift yesterday, and I'm working at a sub shop, so I'm not working doing anything hard, really. It's more just the fact that I don't know how much time I'm going to have to uh, put towards YouTube right now. Uh, if I get time, it'll be it'll be very little time. Like right now, I'm not working. I have a day off today, so. Uh, other than that, I don't think really much has changed since I last recorded a video. Um, I actually am getting back onto the podcast this week because I've been off of that podcast so long and I miss everybody. We had some good times. We were um, discussing new hosts and things like that. So we also were looking for, we're always looking for new guests and things like that to come on the podcast and just to uh, have a good time. So if you have a YouTube channel and you think that you would, would uh, be a good fit to be on the Game Troop podcast, I don't know if you, everybody really knows what I'm talking about when I'm saying the Game Troop podcast, but for any of my new subscribers, I'm on a podcast. <clears throat> it's pretty much all just gaming news. So if you guys have a channel and you would like me to get you on the podcast, I can see what I can do. Just like, um, let me know what you do uh, as far as your YouTube. And I will definitely see what I can, uh, if I can talk to some of the guys on the podcast. Um, we'll be done. I think we're going to. I can't remember how long I record these episodes usually, but uh, usually I think 20 minutes, so got about five minutes left to go. All right, there's our bridge. We need some more dirt, and we'll start working out this path over to the blacksmith. Okay. So now, let's look at this. Do we want gravel or do we want a different material I wish they would just hurry up and put, bring out the next title update so we can have the upside downstairs because I know those are coming and then we can start working back on the castle which is <clears throat> gonna need a lot of changes in this whole area right here this sorry this whole oh my god that whoa this area right there the front area <laughs> If I had a mouse, that would have been a lot easier to do. But, okay, so... Oh! Whew! The lava's right there. Anyways, I think we're going to do gravel. Gravel and cobblestone. Much like the gravel and cobblestone mixture that's down by the blacksmith. I know I have a lot of gravel. But I don't know... Actually, yeah, I have plenty of cobblestone, too. Alright, so we grab some cobblestone. Grab some more cobblestone. No. Just one thing of cobblestone, and we're going to go mainly gravel, so that's up at the top. Are you kidding me? We don't have gravel? No way. That can't be. What? I kept, like, all the gravel that I've ever found. Maybe it's in that other chest over by the blacksmith. I don't think so, but it could be. Did that just heal four hearts? I mean, four hunger bars? I don't know, whatever. We have no gravel whatsoever. You gotta be kidding me. Are you joking right now? Alright, well. Uh, I guess we can start a little bit with this cobblestone. Oh, okay. We're going to have to put this on in the ground. These ones are also going in the ground. And this one, too. These ones can stay out like that. All right, well, that is pretty much it for this episode. Um, I'll keep working on this just a little bit. Um, I'm going to go get some gravel, first of all. I don't know where I'm going to get the gravel, but I'm going to go get some gravel. And... 
next time we can start working on this path. Or we might even go exploring out that way, because I think that's more towards one of the corners. Uh, might even... There's a cross here. Awesome. Okay. Uh, yeah, we might even find the ender, uh, ender portal. So thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode.